Hey, it's Liz, and today I wanted to talk about psychedelic research and psilocybin therapy. The molecular structure of psilocybin, a naturally occurring psychedelic compound found in magic mushrooms, allows it to penetrate the central nervous system, and the scientific and medical experts are just beginning to understand its effects on the brain and mind as a potential as therapeutics for mental illnesses. Backed by $17 million in funding, researchers build on previous work and expand research on psychedelics for illnesses and wellness. One, to develop new treatments for a wider variety of psychiatric and behavioral disorders with the aspiration of treatments tailored to the specific needs of individual patients. And two, to expand research in healthy volunteers with the ultimate aspiration of opening new ways to support human thriving. Previous studies by John Hopkins medical researchers showed that psychedelic treatment with psilocybin relieved major depressive disorder symptoms in adults for up to a month. They also reported in 2014 that a small number of longtime smokers who had failed many other attempts to drop the habit did so after a carefully controlled and monitored use of psilocybin. In 2016, a substantial majority of people suffering cancer related anxiety or depression found a considerable considerable relief for up to six months from a large dose of psilocybin. In a small study of adults with major depression, two doses of psilocybin given with supportive psychotherapy produced rapid and large reductions in depressive symptoms, with most participants showing improvement and half of participants achieving remission through the four-week follow-up. So psilocybin is a really effective method for treating mental illnesses and hopefully with more research in the future um, they can find that it helps many other disabilities and illnesses as well.